Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Gabe, Mr. Health Junkie. Um, I'm coming to you because what the hell's going on? What the hell is going on in our world today? With all the shootings, it seems like there's a shooting every day. What's going on? The tension, the tension. You can cut the tension with a knife. The air is thick. Like, wow. Like, it's overwhelming. So I'll tell you a quick story. So I'm I'm coming. Um, I'm getting off of work on Friday. A buddy of mine's like, "Yo, Gabe, um, I need a huge favor of you." And I said, "Yo, shoot, what's what's going on?" He said, "Well, I know you're trying to change the world and you're trying to spread your message of love and positivity. I need that tonight." Pause. And I said, "Well, what are you talking about?" He says, "Well, with everything going on, let's go downtown. Let's hit the streets and unite the people." So I said, hey, man, <laughs> I'm about this life. You're not saying anything. Let's do it. So uh, another buddy of ours came. There was only three of us. Another buddy of ours, he has like a printing press at his house. And he printed up some shirts. And they it said thugs in red letters, uh, bold, across the front. And it's an acronym that stands for togetherness helps us grow safely. And we had some uh, posters. And we went downtown. While everybody's partying and drinking and going to clubs and stuff, we were downtown trying to make a difference. We were downtown uniting the people instead of dividing us because that's all the media is trying to do. And that's all they're trying to portray is division. They want to divide and conquer. And now more than ever, it's important that we stand and we stand united together. And so that was the message we went downtown with and we united the people. It was beautiful. You know, um, we must understand that we must come together and fight together and not let fear guide us. If you watch the news, I don't watch the news, but if you watch the news, it's nothing but fear based. That's all they're pumping in your may, your brain. They're pumping fear. I wonder why. I'll tell you why. Because you lose energy. When you let fear guide you, you lose energy and nothing grows out of fear. You cannot grow and rise if you're afraid. That's why it's fear-based. And that's why they're pumping and they're trying to make it a race thing. You must understand race is a man-made idea. It's man-made to separate us. Because separation is the greatest illusion ever created. There's no race. Guess what race there is? It's the human race. We are all one. Okay? We are all one. And we must understand that. And we must unite. So I went downtown. When I was downtown, I even met with cops. Okay? And it heals. It, it hurts my heart because there's still a lot of good there's a lot of good cops out there and the good outweigh the bad. But, you know, all they're pumping is the bad one. So I was talking to the cops and they're like, wow, it's refreshing because they're there. There's tension with them as well, because they don't know if people are going to come up and try to hurt them and kill them. Same with the minorities and same with people, just regular people. People are scared, afraid of cops. And so it's just like. With all this fear, that's what they're pumping. And they to, to, to divide and conquer. We must not fall into their trap. Okay? And we need the good cops on our side. We've handed our power over to people who don't have our best interest in hand. They've never had our best interest. They could care less about us. And we must, what we do, what we need to do is we must detach from their system and bring the power back to the people. That's the way we have to unite to do that. Standing together and fighting together is the only way we're going to win against the establishment. Okay? I challenge you to do the same thing. Get out in your community. Whether you go to church or your, your local neighborhood YMCA, I don't know, do what I did. Go out on a Friday night and, and try to unite the people because we need to during this time especially. And people need to understand that we are all one. 
race is a man-made idea. Don't fall into that trap. And if you're going to go march, just be careful because stuff I'm reading, I can't confirm it 100%, but they're planting people in marches to ensue more violence. Where they're peaceful marches, but they're planning people to cause violence and ensue violence. So if you're going to marches, be careful, okay? So that's all I wanted to say. Together we will rise and together we are stronger. We are more powerful than we know. We can do this, but we can't do it if we are divided. That's the only way they're going to win. That's the only way. Love, guys. Until next time, appreciate it. Subscribe to the channel and we'll talk soon.